Hi, my name's Liz Frankel. I'm an artist and a writer and I'm here today to talk to you about my children's books and in particular this one, Hairy Nose, Itchy Butt. Before I talk about the book, I'll talk to you a little bit about what drives me to write. I write because I want you all to become really good readers and writers. The single most important thing you can do in your school life to become a good reader and a writer is to read every day. And that's where books come in. The other thing that I'm really passionate about is the natural environment um, and the need to take care of it. And all my children's books have a message about the environment in there. So to become interested in the environment and to understand it, you have to get out and get to know it. I'm really, really lucky because I live in the bush and I have a really, really big backyard. So I immerse myself in nature all the time. So I'd like to share with you a bit of that. So come with me and check out my backyard. It's raining, but check out this for a big backyard. Living here on the banks of the wonderful River Murray has taught me everything about the need to care for the land, to care for the sky and the air we breathe, and to care for the birds and the animals um, and the plants so that they can all provide what we need. So clean water to drink, clean air to breathe and food, for our food. I'm just going to go pick a gum leaf off of a tree. Now if you're lucky enough to have a gum tree in your backyard, I'd like you to go out and pick a leaf. Then I want you to fold it up and fold it up and fold it up. Keep folding and scrunching the leaf. If you can't reach a fresh one from up in the tree, you can grab a dry one from the ground. And then keep scrunching until it gets really quite gooey in your hand. And then have a smell. Oh my goodness. Oh, here comes my dog. You want to have a smell, Rosie? Makes you sneeze, doesn't it? Yeah. It's really strong smelling of eucalyptus and it's just wonderful. It's come straight from nature. It smells like you might, might have smelt it in chest rub or maybe cleaning products, but it's eucalyptus, it's natural. So that's your little lesson in nature today. So if you would like to get any more little lessons in nature, please pick up one of our books and have a read today. Um, and if you would like, you can go to the YouTube clip of me reading Harry Knows Itchy Butt, so you can actually listen to me read it to you in your own home. So thank you very much. Um, enjoy and keep reading every day. Thanks, guys.